Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we will be doing a review for this seventh song by Victoria Schwab. So, I firstly want to say that I gave this book to 2.75 out of 5 stars. I have been putting off reading it for so long. I kept hearing amazing reviews, especially from one of my favorite booktubers, Books with Chloe. So I decided to pick it up now because it's October and it's a perfect book to read. But I have to say I'm kind of disappointed by it. it. I can see why a lot of people love it, but it just didn't click with me. Yeah, I enjoy the story uh, with August being a monster and doesn't want to accept a part of him because he thinks he's evil. And then with the girl that her name, I can't remember right now, sorry. Um, she is the daughter of the rival part of the city. Uh, and he, she wants to be like her father and then she meets August and they walk together become friends and maybe something more I'm not sure by the end of the book we really don't know it was left open so yeah I enjoy uh, that, that a different monster has different powers for example August's brother uh, plays every instrument uh, and he can sing to feed from from people who have done something evil and their shadows are moving. August only can use his violin to play his song in order to feed and the other uh, monster, his, uh, his sister, can only use her voice to sing so she can draw their energy from people and feed. This book was very slow and I have I had a very difficult time reading it because at first there are a lot and there is a lot of information dumping from the author and it kinda overwhelms the brain. So I pushed through it into the middle and I still wasn't really enjoying it but I really wanted to finish it to have a conclusion about my opinion. So yeah I really didn't like it, so I don't think I will be continuing with the series because everyone said this book was amazing and the second book wasn't so good. So for me, the second book will be awful, I believe so. So I decided to not continue with the series. Even though Victoria Schwab is one of my favorite authors, I have read Vicious by her in her new adult series and I wasn't disappointed, I gave it 4.5 or 5 stars. So yeah, I just, I mean, this series wasn't for me. Anyway, thank you so much for watching my review. Uh, like and subscribe and stick around for more. Also, if, if I have a review posted on my blog about this book if you want to read a more detailed uh, review. And I would really, really appreciate it if you would check out my Instagram, Books with Natasha. And I will see you in my next video very soon. Bye.